Hey everybody, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to set the data fields and watch face on your Garmin Instinct 2X Solar. If you've watched my videos in the past or if you've had the Instinct 1 or Instinct 2 models, it's gonna be basically the same thing here. First thing you're gonna do is you're gonna to wanna to pick the watch face that you want. So I'm gonna go ahead and start by pressing and holding the middle button on the left-hand side, that's our menu button. The very first thing you will see when you press and hold the menu button is your menu and the first option you have is watch face. We're going to press the top right button, which is the GPS button. That'll take us to our watch face, and then you're basically going to be in a listing of all the different watch faces you can choose from. You can go download additional watch faces for this model from the Garmin Connect IQ app if you wanted to. You can simply use the up or down button on the left-hand side and go through to find the watch face that you want to use. I'm just going to choose one of them here. Let's choose this one. It doesn't matter. Actually, I'll tell you what, since I'm actually setting my watch face, I'm going to choose one of the ones that has the white display and the dark font. For me, it's easier to see that versus the inverted option. Once you've got your watch face selected, we're going to press the GPS button to confirm that watch face. And then you've got two different options. You can either apply it. That basically means it's going to set that watch face as is on your profile or on your device, I should say. Or you can press the down button and go to customize. Then we're going to press GPS to choose customize. Now we're in the field customizer for the given watch face. You will see a blinking field. This is the field that you can control. And then you can use the up or down button to cycle through all of the different field options that you've got for that given field. If you have watched my videos in the past, some people have even complained about how much I talk about it. My favorite data field is the moon phase. So I'm going to put moon phase up here in the top right corner. I'm going to press the GPS button. That will take me to my next uh, watch face. Again, I'm sorry, my next data field on the watch face. Again, we can use the up or down button and we can cycle through all of the different options that we've got. I'm just going to choose one. There's my altitude value. I'm going to press the GPS button. It takes me to my next uh, data field. And we're going to continue this same process through all of the data fields for this given watch face. I like the battery level. I'm going to press GPS. It takes me to the bottom one. Again, I could go through all of these. Let me just show you some of the options down there. That's pretty boring, but let's choose that one. Press GPS again, you'll notice that check mark. What that means is we've gone through all of the data fields on the given watch face and we have customized them. The nice thing about the Garmin Instinct watch is if we go change to a different watch face, it will remember the way we had this one customized. So it's kind of cool. You can have one watch face that you use for when you're at the office. You have one watch face you use for when you're doing your activities. You have a different watch face you use for when you're out hunting or fishing, whatever it is. Uh, it's nice that they're customizable. It's nice that it remembers them. Anyway, that is how you customize the data fields and change the watch face on your Garmin Instinct 2X. As always, I hope the video helps. Thanks for watching.